welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in to yet another video. And you guys, I hope you guys are having an amazing day today. I hope you guys had a great holiday weekend. Oh my goodness, I feel beautiful, you guys. I just got my hair done today, okay? You guys, I am super excited because today I'm bringing you guys the Dominican flag. Yes, I'm bringing you guys the Dominican flag after this long. I don't know why it took me this long, you guys, but yes, I am here today with the Dominican men. You know what? I'm so excited that we might just make this a challenge. Yes, the Dominican flag. I cannot believe it took me this long to bring it because I cook this meal all the time. This is basically, you know, this is our flag. That's why we call it the flag. So basically, you got to have white rice. You got to have red beans or pinto Dominican beans. Um, seasoned the Dominican way with the cilantro and all the goodness in there, you know. And I have stew beef on the side to go with it. I'm going to tell you guys more about what the Dominican flag is, why we call it the Dominican flag. And yeah, you actually, this dish, you can um, complement it with plantains, salad, ma yeah, majority of the time salad, avocado, um, sweet ripe plantains, or green tostones, or in my case, banana. I'm going to have a banana with it very this might be really strange for you guys but i'm gonna have my banana something that we typically do um back home so i'm gonna have my banana right here on the side because i'm gonna need that banana baby i made the beans i was cooking today and i was like am i gonna record a video but then i was thinking but i'm cooking and then i'm thinking but why not why not show my audience how I normally cook and eat when I'm home not recording for the family, for the kids? You guys, I'm so excited. I can't believe it took me this long. I have some beef here. We're going to make it the real way. goodness in there some gravy. this is what we call the Dominican flag you guys yes it has to have rice beans and your meat could be chicken give you the first bite could be chicken uh, beef in my case, I have beef. Um, let me take the first bite. Mmm. I will eat with a spoon, you guys. I'm going to do it. Like if I was off camera. I don't want to make it too messy, so. Mmm. Mm. So comforting. Home. This is home right here. Take a little bite of the banana. Put it in there. I'm gonna give you a bite with the banana. Mm. Mm. Beef. Chicken or pork. Mm. Gotta be the Dominican way though. Mm. You gotta have it this way. Mm. This way. Mm. Mm. I 
I would say 90% of households in Dominican Republic is having the flag in some way or another. Every day. Every day. Mm. The last time I had it with um, ripe plantains. Mm, so good. You don't have to eat it with a spoon, but that's what we do. We eat it with a spoon. Mm, it's so messy. Mm. Full of flavor. Mm. Mm. And the banana. Mm. When I was pregnant with my son, I used to crave a lot of banana with my meals. A Dominican thing. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. And that meat's so tender. Mm. 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 In DR, mm. every day. Mm. Rice and beans, for sure. Mm. This is home. I have some Coca-Cola, of course. Mm. But back to what I was saying. In the yard, we have this every day, pretty much. But at 12 o'clock in the day, 1 o'clock, we have all day to work these calories. All day. Mm. And the sun hitting you pretty hard every day. So you sweat a lot. Mm. So you burn all of this up. So they eat like this every day. I want to see you guys have the Dominican flag meal experience. Mm.
we can name it the Dominican flag the DR flag Mm. Mm. the dear flag meal challenge get you the flag and this is a Dominican basically national and this is the Dominican flag mm, mm, mm. some Dominican Sasson and now if you have tried it let me know how y'all like it if you have had the flag let me know how you like it mm. I tell you sometimes you just have to allow things to happen. Just have to allow things to happen. I just came up with this. I just couldn't believe that I haven't shared with you guys our national dish. That's good. Mm. I need to find a way to work this out tonight. I really do. How you guys like my hair? It's gonna change soon. Can't keep up with the blunt bleaching that side of my hair all the time. Mm. So satisfying. So let me recap because, yeah, I've been, I have not put our challenge yet. All right, let's recap on my first challenge, right? Because this is my first challenge. 
Okay, so the DR, the DR flag meal challenge. Okay, you gotta have your white rice, your red beans, pinto beans, and your choice of meat. You could complement it with your choice. I'm gonna leave that up to you guys. It could be salad, it could be plantains, whatever you like, banana, I don't know, avocado, get creative. Get creative with however you want to complement your meal with and tag one person, just one person to do this DR flag meal challenge. That's gonna be fun. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm looking now. I'm gonna be excited to see who is willing to try it out and have fun and make sure y'all tag me for sure. And yeah, oh my goodness. Sometimes you just don't know how things are gonna work. See, I didn't even know. Now I have my first challenge out. Although I'm working on other like two or three different challenges, ideas that I've been having, but sometimes you just gotta go with the flow and you know, God is gonna send you the creativity and the ideas you need. <sighs> this is so good. So, so good. So satisfying. I am so full. <sighs> Excuse me. If you are on the burp club, that was for you. Oh my goodness. <sighs> well, you guys, this is it for today's video. If this is your first time tuning in, make sure you give me the big like. If you like this video, make sure you give me the big like right? <laughs> Subscribe and make sure you hit that notification bell. That way you're notified every time I post a new video. I love y'all and see y'all in the next video. Bye.